Celsius does not work for me. I got me some coffee going. I tried to make me go to rehab. I said no, no, no. Let me go in here and make some cars for y'all. Tell me what you see in me. Gotta be. Hey y'all, sorry for the weird angle. Bear with me for a minute. Let me take this off my head. I'm at work. <sighs> Ow. All right, girls, you already know what's going on. So, I am at work on day shift. It is 6.49 a.m. And if you already know, I work midnight. So why am I at work at 649? Just getting here? Because they texted me while I was on vacation in the pool to report the day shift temporarily because of whatever is going on at this plant. They running out of parts or something. They eliminated midnights. Now you already know that we can't adapt to midnights as it is because we're zombies. Now they want to just switch us to days like that. Anyway, how y'all doing? My name is Lori. Welcome back to my channel. Y'all welcome back. I see y'all love that vlog I did in Jamaica. I loved it too. And I want to go back when it's not hurricane season. But we did get some sunshine. And the bride got her wish getting the sun on her actual day. So good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that trip was fun. And I'm looking forward to the next one. Uh, if you haven't subscribed already, please go ahead and do so. I would love to see you over here every week. Every week. But anyway, let me go in here and make some cars for y'all. And uh, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Good morning, y'all. Happy Friday. It is Friday and I'm off work today. So, the weather's supposed to be acting right. But, you know, I'm trying to uh, get my life together. Since I've been back from this vacation, I have not been vlogging. I have not been cleaning. I have been sleeping and working. That's it. So, last night... When I got home from work, I cleaned up. <laughs> Last night, I got home from work and I cleaned up. And my kitchen was crazy. And my room was getting, well, my room was always clean, but it was my closet. So, yeah, I'm trying to get back. Okay, I'm trying to get back. I just um, got off the shower and laid my hair down a little bit. It's growing out a little bit, so I'm gonna cut it down eventually. But I'm liking my short hair. I like it. I got on this little outfit today. Let me show you what I'm wearing today. That's what I got. And about to fall. This little lightweight see-through pants. I don't know who they're by or where I got them from. It's so old. I'm just so happy to be back in my clothes. You know what I'm saying? So, ooh. I got me some coffee going. Yeah. Alright, let's see what's going down today. I'll talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, happy Saturday morning. I just want to show y'all this. So, you see these waist beads? These are elastic, right? But this one is a screw-on one. And I got it made to fit me perfectly. Now look at that. It's too big. It's hanging down here. So now I have to take this off. This is no good. Yay. So let me unscrew it. So yeah. That's it for that waist bead. No good here. So now I just got on the elastic ones. Which are better anyway. Because they stretch with you. 
whether you gain weight or lose weight. So yeah, just thought I'd share that with y'all. And let me show y'all what I got on today. About to chill out outside. Look at all these jeans from, do y'all remember Newport News? That's where these jeans are from. And I got on Pumas today with the little yellow on the bottom because I got it, the little yellow top from Fashion Nova. And that's what it's given today. So, yeah. Your girl still trying to be fine one more time. Yep, I said that. Trying to be fine one more time, but I'll talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, I just picked up a new drink. I'm gonna try this drink on camera with y'all. It's a C4 Tropical Mango. Tropical Passion Fruit. Not Tropical Mango. It's zero sugar and it's supposed to give you energy because Celsius does not work for me and they no longer make the drinks that work for me, which is a bang. If y'all remember that drink. Let's try the passion fruit. I wanted to get watermelon, but I always get watermelon. Let's try. Oh, please be good. Okay, it tastes just like what it says, tropical passion fruit. I just want to see if it gives me some energy. So I'll let y'all know if it gave me energy or not, because I'm sweepy. Good morning. It's Monday morning, and I'm so happy because we got to do a try on haul for my old clothes that I've been putting away because I couldn't fit. I got to share this happiness with y'all. Like, I done pulled out my whole, like, tote of, like, two small clothes like this. That's my little clothes that I refuse to give up on. So, we're going to try them when I get home tonight. We're going we gonna to try on some clothes and we're going to celebrate. Because if you don't celebrate your victories and bask in the moment and stuff, you'll fall back into whatever you was in before. So, I think you should celebrate all your um, milestones and victories and accomplishments and just live in the moment. Celebrate it, acknowledge it, pat yourself on the back. Don't just, you know, blow passes and sweep it under a rug because you accomplished something. If it took years or months or whatever, you need to acknowledge it. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to do that. <laughs> that's going to be a little bit like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just trying to make it fun or whatever, but I'll talk to y'all soon. Y'all, I wanted to show y'all this coffee. I was so excited when I found it. I'm like, this is the pancakes that I would eat at Aya Hop. They made coffee. Okay. But, alert. Please don't buy that. Don't buy it because it tastes like water. It's like... It's like too thin. It's I tried all the settings of the coffee maker and stuff. Tried to make a smaller cup. But it's just too watery. Don't buy that. Okay, bye. So we just got an oil change at the Lincoln dealership. Did y'all like that waterfall? I thought that was so peaceful. They have such pretty furniture in there and you know, to soothe you while you're giving them all your money, I guess. But <laughs> we got an oil change and now I'm about to go to TJ Maxx. I need some skinny syrup and coffee and that's where I get my stuff from mostly. And I will talk to y'all soon. Hey y'all, it is Tuesday. It's 11.20 a.m. and we are at the gas station. 
want to fill up and then we got to go to Best Buy and get my new mic. Enjoy Mar told me about this new microphone for Sony cameras and I'm about to go pick it up. They sent me an email. It's it arrived two days earlier than expected. So yeah, we love that. So that's what we're about to do. Hey y'all, I got on my new uh microphone. I have to test it. Testing, testing. One, two. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Okay, y'all, so we just came from TJ Maxx and I got what I. Uh, I'm dropping stuff. I got what I went in there for, which was coffee, and I chose blueberry as usual. And for my syrup, though, I got the sample pack again. I didn't too much care for the mocha one, but it's okay for last minute. But I got the salted caramel and the vanilla. I love these because they look cute already on your counter. You don't have to put them in something else. And it was three for six ninety nine. They're pretty good size too. And also, I finally found a MagSafe case for cheap cheap in TJ Maxx. I got a neutral color because I'm tired of this color, the clear one. It's all beat up and old. So we're gonna switch out to this one, cute. And this was only. $8.99 and this was from AT&T for like $40. What? Because when I bought the phone, I didn't even want to leave the store without a case. So I told y'all I had to go get this from Best Buy. This is my microphone for the camera. See, it just goes on the top. And we will do an unboxing for that on TikTok and on YouTube. So that's what we got today, y'all. It's hot today. We finally got a real summer. It's 83 degrees. And I'm here for it. I need my haircut, y'all, but I don't know who's gonna do it this time. Kevin is always busy. He got a hundred things going on. That's the groom that just got married. Hey y'all, happy Wednesday. So I am testing out my new mic. Mm-hmm. Testing out my new mic, and I'm about to do that. Um old school try on haul not old school but back when i was smaller try on haul so <laughs> i got a whole tote like i told y'all i got a whole tote of clothes that i used to fit. is that a word used to fit. <laughs> now i think that i could fit them again because i'm at the same number i guess that i was I lost uh, 25 pounds now. Last time I checked with y'all, it was 20, 20 pounds. So, we're going to do that after I get myself together because I just woke up. It is, I don't know, 9, nine something in the morning on Wednesday. And I'm going to get in the shower and get ready for the day and then show y'all some stuff. And then... I hope y'all celebrate with me and I hope I could be an inspiration to someone just struggling. I used to lose weight so fast and now, you know, that age hits, that metabolism slows down and you like, oh, excuse me, excuse me, you need some bigger clothes. Uh, no, I don't. I need to lose some weight. Like, mm -mm. So I went back to old school ways of like no carbs, no carbs and vegan. Like, pfft. I mean, how can I not lose weight like that? Right? So anyway, that's enough talking. So I'll see y'all in a minute and it's probably going to be a voiceover because we all know try on hauls are very exhausting, extremely hot. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, y'all, stop looking at me. You're making me nervous. Okay, so if y'all remember way back when, a year and a half ago, 
This was my challenge pair of pants that I challenged YouTubers to pull out their oldest item to see if they could fit it. And how long has it been since you've been holding on to that dream of fitting that item? You won't let it go for nothing. Well, this is the pair of pants. I'm going to link the card up above so you can click on that video. I couldn't fit these pants to save my life. They are so small and tight and challenging. But look at me. <laughs> look at me, y'all. <laughs> I got in them. It's even room in the back. Yeah. Okay, now these pants are from Cali, Colombia when I took that trip there. I love them so much with the tie on the waist and the ties on the ankle part. I love them so much. They're like a paper bag type of look. I couldn't fit these for anything back then. And I'm like, I'm getting these pants. They were from Forever 21. And look at me now. Yeah, I love these. So cute. Now, these cute snakeskin pants are from at least 10 years ago in California from TJ Maxx. They are a size four. Yep, you see that four. Four. <laughs> it took me forever to get in those. Now, they do have some stretch to them, but uh, your girl don't wear a four for real. Like, I don't know what kind of four this is, but I'll take it. They're so cute. Now, these pants are so unforgiving. They have zero stretch at all. Look at the detail. So cute. Okay, so I finally took that black top off. I was not going to be changing my top over and over. Okay, these are super old as well. They are true religion purple pants. They are so cute and old. And that is my Puma jacket that I am pairing with it. Okay, so these are the pants that actually goes with this Puma jacket. These Puma pants are very unforgiving leggings. They have no stretch. I don't know what kind of leggings has no stretch, but these are them. I love this outfit. Okay, I just threw on this Adidas jacket, which is adorable. But these little jeans are so small, and I'm in them. Yes. This was a three-piece from Amazon, but I threw out the bralette because it was really tiny. But this duster is cute, and these pants are fire. I got this from Aaliyah's face page. She had one on. So cute. This outfit is very form-fitting, and I love these pants. These are by Guess. They are super small, and this top is very flattering for my figure. I love this outfit. I can't believe I could fit these clothes now. Okay, hey y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed that little quick try on haul with my old clothes that I got my big old butt in and my thunder thighs in. I guess they're a little less thunder. What's one step under thunder? Uh, lightning thighs? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I enjoyed that. It made me feel happy today. I feel so accomplished. I'm sticking to my low carb ways because it's the only thing that I ever resort to that actually works if you stick to it. So yeah. Tell me which outfit you love the most in the comments. Let me know and let's get this day started. Talk to y'all in a minute. Bye. back from Kroger I had to grab a few things actually I just needed some fruit so I can make a little fruit bowl and I picked up some blackberries strawberries and I found some 
almond milk chocolate pudding. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> oh, I don't know. But we're gonna find out. And of course, my almond milk creamer, the one that I love so much. But yeah, that's all I had to get from there. Let me do my fetch rewards real quick. five they added five to my points but i got a hundred i got a hundred yesterday too bad i wasn't recording that one okay y'all so i gotta record this part again because i'm having technical difficulties i don't know what happened but there is absolutely no sound on that clip I made for y'all, so I got to do it again. <laughs> it's called reenactment, okay? So, here goes. And I'm going to insert a clip of the first one. That's funny. Okay, so I made y'all like a playlist of my workout songs, and it was so. <laughs> y'all just don't know the behind the scenes of trying to do YouTube. Everybody think it's just so easy. It's just not that way all the time. But okay, here goes. So. I made a playlist of my workout songs because it keeps me going and motivated and I'm not one to show my working out while I'm trying to lose weight. I don't feel comfortable with that, like showing all that, like all my shaking and wiggling and jiggling and stuff. I, don't, I ain't trying to show all that. Some people don't mind working out on camera, but I don't want to do it. But anyway, so here's my playlist, y'all. Y'all youngsters ain't gonna know this music, but well, maybe if y'all have fly parents like their mom and daddy who was jamming too. But anyway, okay, so here go the first song. be the jam don't play how many months did y'all sing this song Let's go. 
Let me talk to you. You see this shit get hot every time I come through. When I step up in the spot, make the place sizzle like a summertime cookout. I know you do. That's why whenever I come around, she's all over you. Don't you wish your girlfriend was hot like me? It's my song forever. Just my song forever. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. show y'all what I got from the vitamin shop um my other clip they got muted <laughs> it had what I got but I drank it already and threw it away so y'all not gonna be able to see it but let's go sit down and do it haul get the water um, I went and got my trusty bang right this is all that really works for me but the guy convinced me to get the um alani creamsicle creamsicle one it's called dream dang what is it i threw it out dream sickle or something some orange drink by alani and he said that's his favorite one so i got that one but y'all see in the clip if i don't it. I don't know. But then 
He told me to get this because I'm doing like a low carb thing. And he said to try these legendaries out. And it's like a Pop Tart. You put it in the microwave for a couple of seconds and it's supposed to taste just like a Pop Tart with only five net carbs. But it's 20 grams of protein in it. So we got to see if that tastes good. It's called a chocolate cake flavored protein pastry. So I'll be the judge on how good it is, but he swore by it. But that Alani drink, it was really good. But I don't know if it's giving me any energy. I don't feel any jitters or anything. But um, what I went in there for was this Maggle 7. I've showed y'all this before. I've been taking this for like six or seven years. And it's a natural magnesium to help everything be all right in your stomach. And everything moves just fine. I don't have to take fiber. I don't have to take anything else. Um, but Mago 7, that's where it's at. That's where it's at. Who told me about this? The lady that started the the seven day smoothie cleanse somebody smith i don't know but i've been taking it forever okay we ain't gonna be out here long the bugs are winning the bugs are winning but <laughs> y'all i'm so mad about them lost clips like it was so <laughs> so long i had to do it over but i think i did a good job in refilming it so but yeah i'll be jamming it when i work out i don't do a lot in the gym but i to be in there i just be really walking <laughs> or just jumping around in the house i i want to be a gym rat i always wanted to be but pff, my body ain't set up to do it so maybe y'all can work out for me i don't know but I will see y'all later.
I go shop by? Um, vitamin D. Okay, y'all. So I got a question. <laughs> Since I got into these pants as well, these are extra small from Pink. Love these pants. They didn't have a medium when I went to get them. So I bought this extra small. That's what they had. That's what I bought. So I'm in them now. <laughs> so I'm feeling myself today. So do y'all think I should cut up with the shirt? You know, after food, totally. Like, should I just wear the shirt like this? You know, and make a knot? Or should I get, you know, off the chain and do it like, like, well, hold on, wait. Should I do it like that? And then like put it under here like that. Should I do that? <laughs> or is that too much? <laughs> what should I do? Should I just Okay, it's like y'all. Okay, so I don't know. Okay, maybe at nighttime I'll put it like this, but not in the daytime. I don't know. <laughs> Your girl trying to search the drawers and look through the clothes now. Cause I'm getting my confidence back. Like I'm back. I ain't been this small for uh, two years, at least. Yeah, two years now. So. We'll see what I'm going to do. But I'm probably just maybe wear it like this at night time. But I ain't going to act the food like that this early. It's early. <laughs> okay, y'all. So I went this way. <laughs> we'll wear it the other way later. But it is time for us to check out the healthy Pop-Tart. Let's see. He said, just keep it in the microwave for a couple of seconds. I'm so scared. Let's see. It looks cute and pretty. Seconds. It's so cute though. It was 329 or 229. I don't remember, but hmm. That's good. It's like a thick pop tart, like a cake. It say chocolate cake protein pastry. It doesn't even taste like a protein nothing. You know, protein got that powdery taste. It's good. I will buy this again. Okay. That's why I ask people at the store, like, what do you like? What do you like? What do you buy? I don't want to be wasting two and three dollars on stuff and I'm going to take a bite and throw it away. Like that C4, that's an awful drink. I don't know who likes that. C4 protein, not protein, what is it? Energy drink? It makes you like this. Oh no, that's not worth it to me. But anyway, y'all, we about to go outside and see what's in store for us today. Yeah, we are near Miyaki's house. Let's go visit Miyaki. That'd be fun. Let's go see what he's doing. Oh, God. Is he going to even remember me? 
Yeah, let's go visit my cousin and Miyaki. Okay, get down. Oh, you hyper. You ain't changed none. You ain't changed not one bit. You ain't changed not one bit. Huh. Miyagi. You are on the couch over here being a king. So y'all already know I am very limited with what I eat because of my picky stuff. So I went to Walgreens today to get me some um, vegan teriyaki jerky. The Beyond Meat jerky. Yes. And this is what I buy to snack on. It is so flavorful and good. It tastes just like meat. I don't know what it is. <laughs> but it was on sale. I'm like, what? It's really expensive. So it was on sale for $4 or something. I don't know what it was, but I was happy. So I bought it. And then I went in the car. I couldn't wait to open it. And. <laughs> Yo, why? I tasted it and it was like, I couldn't even bite it. It was like leather or something. I couldn't even do that one. I'm like, okay, maybe it's a bad piece. And then I tried another piece and another piece and I couldn't even chew it at all. It was like dried out and gross. This is the most like moist um, jerky I've ever had. Probably because it's not real meat, but it's just so good. I always get it. But this, uh-uh. So I'm like, well, let me see. Is it outdated or something? Why was it on sale? Because Beyond Me don't even go on sale, okay? First of all. So look at this date. I would say $5.29. That's the normal price. It was like $4. So look at this date. I don't know if you can see that date. It says, best before February 28th, 2023. Four months ago, that's when it was the best. Okay, Walgreens, y'all selling outdated stuff. Can y'all do that? Can they sell outdated stuff and put it on sale? Uh, we gonna find out when I go back to the store tomorrow and get my money back. No, I'm sad because I really love this. Now I gotta go to a real store like Walmart or something and get it. I usually order it off Amazon in a big old box. They have these little snack packs. Anyway, enough about that. But I said, okay, if I'm going to drink, eat that, I got to drink something. So I said, let me give me some water. Guess what? Y'all, they got water with cucumber already in it. You don't have to cut up cucumber and put... Okay, let me slow down. I'm jumbling my words together. You don't have to cut up cucumber anymore to put in your water. It comes already in it. So it says cucumber and lime by Smart Water. It tastes really good, just like cucumber water, but the lime kind of scared me, but you don't taste any lime. So good and refreshing. So 
Go get you some of that. They had strawberries, key lime, or strawberries something too, but they they had that for a long time. But this is new. It's new to me. But yeah, we gotta go to Wal we gotta go to Walgreens and tell them about this. We don't eat expired food over here. We we don't do that. Okay, while well, I'm looking for all those clothes to try to fit, now my closet is jacked up. I gotta hang all these clothes. <laughs> Look. Get all those clothes. I'll throw these chairs in here. I, I don't know what's going on, but ever since I came back from Jamaica, I can't get it together. So, we about to hang these clothes up. Yeah, right now. Okay, no more pile of clothes on the chair. I took those chairs out and put those in there. Hung up all the clothes. Hung up all the clothes. Put the other clothes in my other closet. And my bed right there is waiting for me. That took a lot. I don't even usually do stuff like that. Just pile my clothes up like that. Man. Does a vacation do that to y'all? Y'all come back and y'all got to do some kind of reset? Oh, man. Okay, so I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. So, how did y'all like seeing Miyaki today? <laughs> he was so excited to see me. I'm like, is he going to remember me? Of course he remembers mama. <laughs> he was looking real poodleish today. You know, he's a Shih Tzu and Poodle mix. He was real jerry curled up looking. He had his mohawk still. That dog did not let me rest one minute while I was over there. I wonder did he cry when I left. He was so excited. Y'all miss Miyaki? Tell him hey in the comments. But <laughs> that dog is crazy. I was like, oh, you ain't changed not one bit. Not one bit. But yeah, I miss him, but you know, he's in better hands over there. They just constantly spoil him. You see, he's allowed on the couch over there. He ain't getting yelled at to get down off the couch or nothing. But let me show y'all the finished um, look of what I did to my house because I am getting a new couch. So I took the little chase out the living room and put it in the other room. Let me show you. This is now my living room. So, this area is where the couch is going to be. I don't know what else is going to go on around here, but this is what it is right now. I love my mirror right here. It's way easier to use. And then this room... Turn on the light. This room is where I put the chase at for now. I don't know what I'm going to do in here, but I just needed a fresh start and a new change. I just changed it around and I'm going to put a picture right there because the whole wall is like so empty. But yeah, I just changed it around a little bit. I'm one of those people that get really bored with things so i just changed it around a little bit but i'm about to get ready to upload this video right here and start on the next vlog and i will see y'all later i hope you enjoyed leave me a comment or two or three and let me know if you're on a weight loss journey because it seems like everybody is trying to lose weight like this week <laughs> so glad that i'm not alone so happy about that 
for me, lately I've been focusing less on doing what they say I can't do and more on doing whatever the hell I want. Good night, y'all. Love y'all.